All right, guys, girls. So uh, the first thing I want to say before we begin with this review about Magi, where I've waited for so long, and it seems like the chapters come out not that fast. I want to say is um, I'm very sick, and I'm really not feeling that great. So we'll keep the review short because I want to put it out there, but I also want to get it done quick. So sorry for everything that's happening that's not really that great. Also, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. That will be really amazing. And if you do not like it, please let me know in the comments why you do not like it. Instead of just giving a thumbs down, that really helps me. So, going on to the real deal. This chapter was really insightful. At first, we saw, of course, Simba. And he's thinking about, uh, talking about... Uh, Alibaba and while well, he's like well it doesn't matter what he do does because the co-empire will badly go bankrupt stuff like that he really doesn't seem like caring at all so I was like alright let's see what uh, Alibaba is going to do so Komei Komei bro Komen is back so the undercover of course because he's exiled exiled um, he's undercover, he's a strategist, he knows a lot of things, and he's a very smart guy, as you already see in this chapter, if you read it, it's an amazing chapter to read. So he's talking about a secret facility where, even in the hardest time money went through, it was a research facility, a secret research facility, and man, in the time that they were away, it has done amazing things it has kept up with all the other stuff that was going around in the world and that's very great to see so we see some very simple stuff like um i'm clicking to it right now it's communication stuff uh something to have some transplantation to human body from 70 to 20 percent 20 percent a 50 percent increase uh, magic vessel stuff, eight pentagram where they can really make people live again, that people revive them. Pretty scary. Alibaba was really not liking it, but just to get on with it. Those co empire people were like, "Wow, well, I'm very. They are very loyal to their land, the country. Uh, they want to fight even when they're dead. They feel like a pride to be fighting even when they're dead." But he was like, "Ah, oh, all right, let's not get into that." And then Komen is talking about that in the East we were fighting with horses and stuff and he was feeling like this would change something. And of course they looked down on sorcery and magic like that. He thought it were more case of miracles. But he was like, well, nothing in the world's really a miracle, so we must investigate that. And he was talking to the people and saying that they should really invest in this and start researching it more and more and when the dungeons came it became clear that everything became really easier to understand and really what made me think that was really what i also thought was that this alibaba saying that was close if this man had been born sooner co would have begun its magic research just a little bit earlier than Magnus did. So it means something because Magnus does mainly magicians and he not, they are not. And he's also saying the Enico Empire would have really conquered the entire world if this guy was born earlier because he is such a genius. <coughs> I'm very sorry for this. I'm really feeling not great. I'm very glad this is the last thing I want to say about it. Um, it's some special research that really has finally has borne its fruit. It's about transportation. Really something that's going to help the transportation. And Alibaba's like, well, we can do this. With this, we can make the co-empire training company. It can become the number one in the world. And that's amazing to see. I'm really excited for that. Thank you for watching. Oh, I'm feeling so terrible right now. Hope you enjoyed it a bit. Please give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Uh, share it with your friends. Subscribe if you want to see more of me. And I hope I'll be better very soon so I can give normal reviews and talk just relaxed. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.